Spiritual soul in the building, sun gazer soul in the building. Now look, bro, I got my boxes and shit on. I was literally just about to hop in the shower, so I'm gonna keep this camera a little high. No homo, no extra shit, man. We coming on here for information, not about how I look. People more concerned about how I look and my safety than actually helping their own life. You care about me more than yourself. I wanna let you know, I care about me more than you. I'm making sure I'm straight. You should be the same way. Focus on yourself. It's that simple. What is wrong with you? When I drop these videos, I'm not doing this shit for entertainment. I have a whole channel with a million subscribers that I could post entertainment on. This shit is serious. You think I'm risking my life? Okay, well take me serious then. Do what I'm telling you to do. Help yourself. Get the information. Dig a little deeper. Stop worrying about how I look and my appearance and all this shit that's distracting you. I'm not here to entertain you. I'm not here to make you laugh. I have a whole nother channel for that. Now check this out. I just dropped a video about the marijuana situation. I told y'all that medical marijuana and regular weed is two different things. Medical marijuana is tampered with. It's like, it's like GMO meat and, and GMO McDonald's versus the other McDonald's in other countries. They, they restaurants is real meat. In America, it's not. So it's the same thing with marijuana. Real marijuana is real. It cures diseases, all type of shit. You could brew it, drink it as tea, etc. Medical marijuana is made for you to smoke and literally take years off your life. It's that simple. I, I, I don't, you can do your own research. Do your own research. Now listen, I want to tell y'all about the experience that I just had. Y'all see I'm right here chilling in front of the mirror. I got my towel and shit right here. I was about to get in the shower. I was literally just about to get in the shower and get my day started with. I literally just dropped a vid for y'all. Let me tell y'all about my experience that I had with mirror gazing. Now, just like sun gazing, you stare at the sun, you get the energy from the sun. Mirror gazing is basically connecting with yourself. Now, check this out. So, y'all see me right now, right? Pay close attention. Y'all see this big ass mirror. Big ass mirror. So before I hopped in the shower, I was going to meditate. Normally, I sit my ass right here in front of the sun and I meditate. Literally sit right here and I meditate. I sit right here on this thing right here. And I just meditate while getting sun, etc. I always meditate when I wake up for like, like, for like 10 minutes. That's all I need. 10 minutes, man. Start my day off right clear. Being in the moment. What is mirror gazing? Mirror gazing is when you stare at yourself in the mirror. It's like you meditating, but you staring at yourself. You got to get to know yourself. When is the last time you took time out, looked in the mirror, and thanked yourself for everything you've been through in life? When the last time you took time out to even take care of yourself? Taking care of yourself is not buying you things. Taking care of yourself is not having a million dollars. Taking care of yourself is not having sex with a whole bunch of girls. Taking care of yourself is going within, focusing on your breath, clearing out toxins, Making sure you straight. You can't do shit for nobody if you ain't straight. So that's what mirror gazing is for. So let me tell y'all my experience. Now, first thing first, I don't recommend you trying this if you're not into meditation. If you are not really taking care of yourself a little, like just a little bit, then you're probably not going to get this experience. You can do it. Look at yourself in the mirror. And thank yourself for what you've been through. Thank yourself for everything you overcame. Just look at yourself like dead ass. I'm thankful for having a million subscribers. I'm thankful for inspiring people on Solomonati Rose. Who the fuck is this? Somebody going live on recording this shit? But, uh... So let me tell y'all what happened. So I set my ass right here. I was looking at myself in the mirror. Like I was about to meditate. I just got relaxed. Then I looked at myself in the mirror, right? Now, it don't take me that long to get into a deep, relaxed state because I've been meditating for a very long time. It only take me like three minutes. So I'm going to tell y'all what happened the first three minutes. So the, when I first started staring at myself, I was just looking at myself regular. I didn't notice anything, to be honest. I did notice I was getting super relaxed, right? I say after about three or four minutes, after I was like talking to myself, like I was just telling me like, I'm, I'm thankful for overcoming all the situations. I'm, I'm grateful for everything that's happening in my life right now. And I was just like, literally like just telling myself it's okay. You know, you don't have nothing to worry about. 
just literally, man, like, we deserve it, bro. We've been through a lot, man. We got to take care of ourselves. We put our bodies through a lot of bullshit that we didn't have to. All the turning up and all the shit we did, it was, it's, it's experiences, man. We did everything we did. Now it's time to take care of ourselves, right? So that's like the mindset that I had, right? And I didn't do enough information on mirror gazing like I was supposed to. I thought it was just simple. You stare at yourself, etc. After the first five or six minutes, after three or four, like after the first two, three minutes, four minutes, I didn't notice anything. I was super relaxed. After about five to six minutes, I started noticing two white lights, like a reflection from some type of light in my eyeball. So if you're looking at me right now, you see nothing. But I had two like bright white lights while I was staring at myself. Now the whole time you are daydreaming, staring yourself in your eyes, bro. Like dead ass looking in your soul, like daydreaming. Right. So when I seen that shit, I'm like, what the, what the fuck? It kind of freaked me out, but it's nothing to be afraid of, bro. It's fear is fear is love. Fear is a thought. Pain is a thought. Your thoughts affect your life. So if you wake up thinking something, that's how your day going to be. If you wake up having a good ass day, that's how your day going to be. If you wake up thinking positive, it's that simple. If somebody cut themselves and they and they think that it's pleasure, you know how people be cutting themselves and they don't even be having pain or making no remarks. They don't feel pain. It's a thought. TV and all this different shit is what made us think that pain is real. TV, games, news. That shit made us think that death is a bad thing. Pain is a bad thing. Pain is love. If you can really brand that into your mind, pain will never hurt you again. Death, you shouldn't be scared to die. Just focus on yourself. Love yourself. You are a mortal spiritual being. You have nothing to worry about. All I watch is stuff that can help benefit my life. Just like mirror gazing. Here I am right in front of the mirror. Trying to figure out what the fuck I need to, trying to figure out what the fuck I need to do, right? So after about the first five or six minutes after I started to see these two lights, these two white lights in my eyes, I say after like seven minutes, literally like a couple minutes later, I started to hear like little noises coming from my bathroom. Now it's not like constant noises. It's like stuff that it just grab your attention. Like you might hear like a tap or something. Now I have no idea what the fuck it was, but clearly my frequency is high enough. I hear different shit anyway. I hear ringing in the ears and all of it is positive. All while I'm hearing this, I'm still looking at myself, right? So I'm so fucking relaxed at this point. I'm super relaxed at this point. Nothing gets to you, bro. You have nothing to worry about. No fear, no nothing. It's you. So I still kept hearing certain noise like something was trying to get my fucking attention, bro. I have no, I have to do my own research. I'm just bringing y'all this vid. Like something was trying to get my attention. I don't know if it was my spirit gods for y'all that's woke. Y'all know what time it is. But after like another couple minutes later, I say after like the eight minute mark, before I even got to like 10 minutes, I noticed that my eyes was starting to go elsewhere. So it went from me staring at, imagine my eyes looking at you right now and then my shit started like doing its own thing. My face started doing its own fucking thing. I, I can't make this up. My eyes started to do its own thing. And what I mean by its own thing, these two eyes was no longer looking me dead in my eyes no more. I don't know what the fuck it was. I don't know what happened. But all I know is I was digging a little bit deeper in myself. Remember, this glob of meat that we is ain't shit. We are not nothing. We are in a matrix. This glob of fucking meat, these two eyes, these two eyes, this smell, this mouth, everything we see, touch, feel, everything is fake. Once you up your level of consciousness, raise your vibration, you can start to hear different shit that you can't hear, that regular people can't. You can start to experience shit that regular people can't. You get different experiences from nature that regular people can't. You get answers from your higher self. How can you become rich? How can you be better in school? How can you become this, that? You ask yourself, your higher self that, and he will give it to you or she will give it to you. You have to connect with your higher self. When you pray to God, the answers and shit that you want, it's in here. Connect with yourself. So what I learned from mirror gazing Mirror gazing is all about self-love. 
you are digging a little deeper in what you really are. So I was looking at myself in the mirror, my regular self, and I started to change. Yes, it was kind of scary at first. And yes, I stopped instantly. I wasn't ready. I needed to I need to do more research. That's why I tell you, get information to do more research. My dumb ass recorded the video for y'all, came in here instead of me sitting and meditating. I came in mirror gaze for 10 minutes. And this is what happened. Quick 10 minutes can change your life. You take 10 minutes out your day to meditate, anything, it can change your life for the better forever. Mirror gazing, sit in front of the mirror, tell you how you thankful, all the shit you overcame, bro. You probably got fired. You probably dropped out. You probably, so, you probably took so many L's, but you overcame it. Thank yourself. Thank yourself sometimes. Take some time out. Look at, ladies, you be in the mirror putting your makeup on. Be in the mirror, look at yourself in your eyes for a good five minutes. Just take a good look in your eyes for a good five minutes and see what happens. No, it's nothing to be afraid of. You shouldn't be afraid of nothing that's coming within yourself. Because everything, we all are one. Everything that you experience is coming from you. Everything you experience is what you believe in. Do you believe in ghosts? You can experience it. Do you believe in demons? You will experience it. You believe in sexy angels? You would experience it. You control your own mind. You control your life. That's why I tell you, stop watching the news. They don't control you. Stop watching TV. They don't control you. Stop playing video games that much. They don't control you. Stop smoking weed that much. It don't control your happiness. You control everything about you. And that's my experience from mirror gazing. I'm going to try that shit again. Not right now. It was different as fuck. It's different. But it's lovely. I'm loving my life. I'm loving the new experiences that I'm getting. It's showing me that it's way more in this life than we think. Than just some TV, music, and video games. And sex. It's way more out here that we could be doing. And experiencing. In a positive, great way that could help everyone. But their job is to make us stay asleep. Their job is to keep us sleep, bro. When you start taking time out to yourself, you just start to finally start getting to know yourself. Anyway, man, that's my experience with mirror gazing. I stared at myself for 10 minutes. The first five, the first three minutes was cool. It was pretty relaxed. I was just talking to myself, conversating with myself. After that, I started to see different bright lights in my eyeballs. Like it was a reflection coming in my eyes, but it wasn't. After that, I started to notice that my face features started to like do its own shit. It was weird. Yes, it's weird. But you have to overcome your fears because fear is not real. Anyway, take this information, do your research, take care of yourself. I love y'all, man. I'm here to inspire. Um, We in this shit together. We got a long way to go. We got a lot of people we have to wake up. Um. Y'all gonna be good, man. Hang in there. I'm here for y'all, man. Email me. If I don't respond, I see your emails. I can't respond to everyone. I get thousands of emails now. It's a lot of people out there that's, that need help just like me, but it all starts with you. I can't give you the answers. I can't help you. I can only give you the information. Spiritual Soul signing out, man.